time here. What's he thinking about? Well, I mean, he's just thinking exactly that. If I go airmail, are, are they too bunched up? Are they too stiff? Is everything going to – am I going to go for this shot and then bounce off the back and then get no return out of it, right? right. If I go with the airmail, I don't mind sacrificing my bag if it means I get – if I get the, the benefit. Yeah, he's thinking a long time, even double clutched. And now he's set. Yeah, he's going to the back of the hole. Lands on top. Uh, one goes, the other one's still stuck. They have not. Oh, wait, it's moving. No, it, has it stopped? Yeah, I think Eric Sockline on the other end said, yeah, it's, it's yeah. stopped. And this is really bad because Halbert, if you were, you know, if you had the other end, uh, if you were the last bag, you'd concede it and be like, I'll walk away. Yeah. But the problem is, Almanza's has got a bag left. Last bag for Halbert. Oh, wow. Oh, they're moving now. They all go. So now here, here, pretty straightforward. You're on the board. You go to 20. You get in the hole. You get four to win. Devin Harbaugh coaching up Almanza right now. You hear the crowd, they're saying send it. That means they want him to hit a backside, back 50% of the whole airmail, low percentage shot to win Crew Cup and an $8,000 prize. Big shot for Noah Almanza. On the way, backside, got it! Wins it for Team Birchfield. A walk-off airmail for Noah Almanza, the rookie in the American Cornhole League that made a splash this year. Gets into the top ten in singles. Hits a game-winning airmail here in the Crew Cup Final. Backside. Couldn't hit it any better, leaving that back sitting there. What a shot by Noah Almanza.